progress has been made by the negotiators, but the, at, the, at the negotiating level, uh, they've essentially hit a wall. Um, as the President said the other day, this Middle East uh, peace process knows no status quo. It'll either move forward towards an agreement or slip backwards towards uh, turmoil and conflict. And I think uh, all of the leaders believe that they must make an effort uh, to try to reach an agreement. We have an opportunity now to try to bring the Israeli-Palestinian part of this conflict, which happens to be the core of the Arab-Israeli conflict, to a conclusion. So there is an opportunity, there is a potential. It's not a surprise that it's enormously difficult. We're dealing with the hardest, most sensitive issues of the conflict between Israelis and Palestinians. We're focused on trying to do all we can to allow them to succeed. They are neighbors, they're going to be neighbors, and there's no alternative to them living in peace together. Well, I got an answer back from President. I, I don't want to comment on his domestic politics. I can only tell you from my dealings with him is that he is determined uh, to move forward and he will make the very hard decisions that are necessary. Well, uh, as Palestinians, we hope that the Israelis are ready for peace. We're not trying to make uh, peace with this government or that government or that party or this party in Israel. We're out there to make peace with Israel, with all Israelis. Uh, I hope that Israel is ready for peace.